Oh shit, I've been muted the whole time? R.I.P, bro. I've been I've been chatting to you guys for literally the last 10 minutes. <laughs> and I've been muted, dude. Unbelievable. Uh, heat check, how you doing, brother? Responsible gambling today, yes, sir. Absolutely. That is what we're gonna be doing. Dr. Squank, thanks for hanging out. Appreciate you guys. I've literally been, been, been muted for the last five minutes. Jeez, jeez Louise. Brutal. Unbelievable. But hey, anyways. Yeah, I don't know, heat check. Uh, we're gonna do responsible gambling today for sure. We got 150 bucks. I know, right? I was like, hello? Is anyone there? <laughs> Uh, yeah, 150 bucks today for the bankroll. Responsible gambling. We're gonna do Iron Cross five dollar units, no deviations, and and just let the let the dice fall as they will. Um, that's so funny, dude. <laughs> Unbelievable. Welcome on in, guys. Appreciate it. This is gonna be the first come out here. Um, I'm not gonna come out. I'm not gonna put any money on the on the come out here. But I, I mean, you know what I've been messing with is is doing the field, uh, just putting the bet out there on the on the come out roll and hedging with the any seven. I've noticed that that's been a pretty good uh, pretty good uh, start because you do get to hit like a uh, like like we would have got paid on on the eight if we would have uh, if we would have put it out there bef before. But then you you know then you lose like a couple bucks so. So this is going to be a $5 unit super press iron cross strategy here. So we're going to have $6 on the 6 and 8, $5 on the 5, and $5 on the field. Um, it's a $22 exposure per roll uh, if it was a point, if it's going to be a point seven out. So it's not, it's not too expensive to get on the board. Um, and you're hoping for somewhat of an extended roll so you can get some more money out on the place bets and you can go from there. But uh, $22 to start. Not a super press, not, not technically. It's going to be a collect then press strategy uh, with the Iron Cross uh, always working here on this website. Hope you guys are having a great day today. Happy Monday to you all. I appreciate you guys hanging out with me again. We've had back to back to back streams. I know this is pretty rare, but I appreciate you guys spending your time here. I got Vicious V behind me taking a nap, but she's here in spirit. Uh, the Iron Cross, um, you place the five, six, and eight because those are non-field numbers, and then you bet on the field. So technically you win on everything except this, the seven. I know, right, Heat Check? I know, can you believe it? I pretty much just paid off your 599 in three days, for sure. As long as this bankroll, um... Vicious V Pog, Vegas next year Pog, Vegas this year, dude. Ve Vegas this year. Yo, uh, Clara OMG, if you look over here, this is all the numbers that we went on except this number, right? So this is a pretty good indication of of how this strategy works. Okay, so what I've noticed with this strategy on this website here is we we're gonna t so once you have your place bets out you can't take them off right so we're gonna bet the field here we're gonna bet an any seven to hedge what we have right we're gonna hedge what we have on the board that actually Dude, let me know when you go to Vegas. Absolutely, heat check. Let's let's make a let's make a plan. At this point, you are the only person that is uh, ever met up with me in Vegas, so you are on the top of my list of people that I will plan a trip around. Because <laughs> I would love to actually spend like a full day, maybe a couple days with you, 
Beautiful. Maybe we could all stay at the same hotel or something like that and have there a great night. Let's get it. Kraus donating the tent. Turn one. Two draw four. Each tray. Um, I saw on Twitter you used someone's sports picks. Was it worth it? Um, no, because he ended up banning me because I asked questions. He kept making new Telegram channels for every week's worth of picks, and I was like, bruh, what the fuck are you making Telegram new Telegram channels for every week? Can you just keep sending them in the same Telegram channel? And he was and then he called me a racist name and he banned me. So was it was it worth it? I would say no. It was not. Um, seven out. We started with 365. We're actually up. We're actually up. So what I what I what I do here is I'm gonna take this. I'm gonna do this and uh, get the get the work get these rolls working with a uh, any any seven hedge. So this is why we do that, right? Because we lose a couple bucks, but we get paid on the eight. And the points established. It's really, really good. Time for the Iron Cross. Why are you mad? We are doing full Iron Cross all day today, brother. For hundred and fifty dollars, or I guess one sixty-five. I'll give him. I'll give him the. I'll give him the the juice on top. That is back to back repeating eights. So this is why this is nice because we just hit back to back eights, right? So we're gonna. Um, we're going to put the unit on there and hedge with this any seven. And if it does hit a seven out, we can re-put up all the bets, right? Because on a seven, we win $30. We can re we can put up this whole bet again for free. Six and a four, ladies and gents. Ten, choose a ten. Ten, easy. Ten, easy. Ten. Marking the ten. So we get paid on the field. We get paid on the field. We lose our any seven bet, but we but but our numbers were working. So that's why I'm kind of that's why I'm kind of leaning towards uh, working our bets on the come out. Was it worth it before that? I mean, he was okay. He was like, he did pretty well. He did pretty well. But no, he's kind of a psycho. So I don't think it was worth it in the end. <clears throat> 12 pays double. Thank you very much. Uh, going to Vegas next month. So stoked to play some craps. Why you mad? Dude, enjoy it, bro. It's a really fun game. Uh, right now, it's a little weird because I think there's like, you know, limits to how many people can be on the table. So um, I think it's like a little bit different than normal just because the tables aren't absolutely packed. But uh, I think you'll have a really good time, man. Just throwing the bones is always a good time. Always a good time. Damn, son, where'd you find this? Hey, thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate you hanging out with us tonight. Six max per table. You get the dice quicker, for sure. Get the, get the bones in my hand. Get the bones in my hand. More chances to roll. Absolutely. Um, that was a hit on our nine. The next, uh, on the next hit, we'll go up to twelve, because we are playing uh, three dollar units technically. Well, uh, if you press, if you're pressing on a six dollar bet, you just go up. Uh, you just go up one unit. Or five. Uh, I love the don't pass, but the last time I played don't pass, I lost seven hundred dollars. <throat> Which was just last night. Check out the VOD. Check out the VOD. <laughs> Check it out. We lost We lost it all on the don't pass. It was like, we were like laying four and ten, had don't come points, and it was just getting, it just repeater after repeater after repeater, getting absolutely smokerinoed. You won 700 last night on it? Good for you. Actually, I've seen your name pop up here on the side. I've, I've seen your name pop up here on the side, actually. Um, 250, 250 press on the five here. We just hit back-to-back -back fives. 
see me lose no less than 24 hours ago. Exactly. <laughs> it's on YouTube. Give me a like and subscribe. <laughs> oh my god. Like and subscribe to see me lose $700 in two and a half hours. <laughs> Playing the don't pass. <laughs> Unbelievable, dude. You were betting double fours last night and getting crazy wins. Double, what do you mean double fours? Hard eights, you mean? I've ever done the Iron Cross live. I have not actually. I have not done the Iron Cross live. I know that dealers are not very happy with you if you play if you play a, a legitimate Iron Cross. Um, I think if you th if you threw them, if you threw them a couple bucks up front, if you throw them like t maybe twenty five dollar tip up front and be like, hey, can you remind me to put my field bet down, and and then like tell them how you're playing your place bets like on a press collect strategy, uh, I think I think they would be uh, I think they would be pretty happy with you playing it. Nice, dude. This is a uh, this is this is printing right now. This is printing. Um, 750, 750 again, we'll press the next time. Yeah, but a $25 tip raises the edge. Yeah, no, come on. But like the, the dealers have to do a lot of work when you're playing the Iron Cross, right? Because every roll is potentially work for them. So if you tip them up front, I'm sure that they'll be a lot happier helping you out while you're, while you're playing the Iron Cross. You just started playing craps yesterday? Really? Well, I hope you're enjoying it. It's a really fun game. Um, I think that uh, if you had success with it, you, you should keep playing it, but don't don't always don't always ex expect the success because it will it will destroy you quickly. Uh, your first time seeing the Iron Cross, how is it uh, so far? Right now, we are uh, just about even after two rolls. Just about even after two rolls. We started with we started with 365. Oh, oh no, Evolution Craps? The rules are pretty bad. I would say that the rules uh, compared to an actual Craps game are are pretty bad. That's a point seven out, which is just absolutely torches us. Port, point seven out just absolutely torches us. <clears throat> um, you have one to one odds. You can't take working bets off. Bets on the pass are always working. Um, I know that a lot of people have complained about the bets working all the time. So that's something that they might, the, the dealers were saying so that's something that they might implement uh, later is they might take off, uh, or they might let you take down or take off bets. Uh, Cause this is technically a soft release. It's not actually, it's not actually fully released yet. So they still are listening to the players complaints and stuff like that about the game. I mean, it's evolution. So take that with a grain of salt. I'm sure that they're trying to make their money anyway, right? Any way possible, but um, you know, you know what I mean. The game of craps, though, I mean, you're always going to have an edge, right? Because you have people playing both sides. So it doesn't make sense for them uh, to, to act like that in a sense where it's like, it's like, dude, come on. You can easily, easily just play this game for pretty much free. Like you can provide this game for free because you have people, you have people playing both sides of the dice. Okay, so this is nice, right? So we hedge with the any seven. We get thirty dollars on the return. We lose a dollar, but we can put back our full bet out on the out on the table, right? So we can put back a full bet here. Uh, six, nine, five, and then the hedge with the any seven. Okay, so this is perfect, right? Since we since we hedged and we got all of our money back on the table, we actually hit the nine dollar eight instead, right? So that's perfect. Now the now the button goes back on the eight. 
If we could have taken our bets down completely, we wouldn't even have to worry about that seven. But we wouldn't have hit. We wouldn't have hit that eight. So I mean, it it it's this. It it comes and goes in the same. You know, in the same way. It comes and goes in the same way. If we were not working, we wouldn't have hit the nine dollar eight. And we but we wouldn't have had. We wouldn't have had to hedge the seven. So I mean, whatever. You can't wait until Stakes gets this. Yeah, me, me neither, man. I, I would have been, I probably would have tiered up. Uh, I probably would have tiered up my VIP after all of the money I've wagered on this game. <clears throat> I think they're changing dice at the moment, to be honest. But I did also lose connection to the game. Well, uh, King Zach, it's not fully released. It's not fully released uh, to anybody yet. And outside of the U.S., craps isn't that big, in my opinion. Uh, yeah, I feel like it is a very, very specific U.S. game. Um, I'm sure that now that it's online, a lot of other people will start playing it. But the nuances and the rules is a big turnoff to a lot of gamblers just because it's so complicated to get into at first glance. But once you understand the game, I mean, it's it's pretty easy to understand. And then and then you're just and then you're just rocking and rolling. I think that they are um, cleaning the camera lens, so I'm gonna play some music until it comes back. Craps is like American football, but hey, everyone loves American football, right? American football. What I always tell people with craps is like, once you understand what you what you're betting it, what your strategy is, you you really you really like simplify the game a lot, right? Because then you understand like why your money is doing what it's doing, you know. American American hand egg. In the EU, nobody watches football. That's just that's just a goddamn lie. I know those British people love their love their Jacksonville Jaguars. <laughs> For some reason, bit British people love Jacksonville. <laughs> it's like, dude, that team is garbage. Why do you like that team? It's funny. Uh, it must be like the logo or something. <clears throat> no, but to be honest, like American football has now become a sport that is just is it's most it's mostly to uh mostly to sell ads in my opinion it's less and less about the sport and more and more about the ad time as, as time goes on lavishka chanot dude i have him on my fantasy team he hasn't been super solid but he's a good player yeah question hit me Um, the KHL, no, I am a big fan of the NHL. I love hockey. Um, I, I know a little bit about the KHL. Maybe like if like a prospect from my team is on the KHL team, but no, I'm a big NHL fan. Don't bet on the KHL. The KHL is, has to be one of the rig most rigged leagues. <laughs> Plagueful wins. Um, yeah, I, I would say that we're almost even after three rolls, so it hasn't been too bad. I would say it's 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 going okay. I'm playing a hundred and fifty dollar iron cross strap for my boy Sparky Polarsti. Uh, he should be in here soon, but he's got he's got some shit to do it uh, before before uh, he can 
He can hide away from his kids. Blackhawks are terrible. Just stop. Wait, FJ, why did you change your name to Clara OMG? I forgot the story. Can you re can you reiterate? Hey, since we have some downtime, have you guys uh, seen the show? Uh, do how long? I think like full. Have you guys seen the show called uh, Raised by Wolves on HBO Max? No, I would say that it depends what I, I would say if your team if your city or your state has an MLS team, I think more people are 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 more willing to watch soccer, but we just we just we obviously just grew up on different sports, right? We got baseball. We have we have we have we have baseball, we have football, we have a bunch of hockey teams. I just feel like soccer is just taking a big back seat to a lot of stuff. But you know, anything can change. And I know it's been getting I know it's been getting a lot more popular as of lately. Oh yeah, yeah, that's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. Okay, I remember now why you changed it. Yeah, MLS is growing, especially if they can get I think I think it will get I think it will get more popular as the years go on, for sure. For sure. It's, it's just not something that can it just can't knock down like it's just not gonna get the prime time, you know, TV slots that like other sports get. So, you know, you have to go on some like random ass side sports channel or sports network and and uh go find a game but it's just it's just not readily available so it's harder to watch and also i think that it's also in, during a season that like it's like football season so it's like why are people gonna people watch why are people gonna watch mls when when they could be watching football at least that's that's what that's what people's thoughts are on it How many lenses do they have to clean? I don't know what they're doing. Are they rigging the arm? Uh, cycling is really big in the US and I've heard during COVID times, bicycles in general are just getting like sold out of shops. There's a part shortage. Everyone's starting to ride a bike now or something like some reason. I don't know. Like I heard that uh, cycling and I heard that uh, guitars like just like like singular hobbies and golf too. like tea times are insanely hard to get like singular hobbies are just are just going out the roof because, you know, people need time to spend their, you know, need something to do with their time now that they can work from home and they don't have to commute and they can ride bikes everywhere now. Let's roll some dice, brother man. Yeah, they're they're doing some maintenance on the table, dude. I would love to keep rolling. Anniversary festival. We run the city into the ground. You come from the Netherlands. We have an estimate of 1.5 bikes per duchy. Yeah, I know. I remember. Uh, I went. Uh, I went to Amsterdam. Yeah, I went to Amsterdam for a vacation and. Uh, getting a coffee at a cafe and it was rush hour and there was it was just thousands and thousands of people biking at rush hour and I was like dude this is crazy this is awesome who runs this joint I'm gonna write an angry email to evolution right now <laughs> these fuck these fucking lunatics can't even clean a lens Five o'clock. It, it, it was crazy, man. And but it but it like it had this like natural flow though. Like some people were turning left, some people were turning right, some people were going straight, and like nobody crashed. Nobody was getting like nobody was like. I mean, there were some bells, there was some ringing ringing of the bike bells, but nobody was like getting close to hitting each other. It's like everyone was just just flowing through this huge body of like bike mass. It was crazy. It was really interesting to watch. I mean, unfortunately, the way that the United States is spread uh, across uh, the land, it's just not possible. And I think also, like, uh, you know, car companies lobbied very heavily 
uh, back in the day to make sure that car travel was the only way to travel uh, going into the future. So it kind of destroyed a lot of infrastructure for bikes and trains and stuff like that. And that's that's actually that's actually proven too. Like the car companies, uh, you know, lobbied heavily against train transportation. It lobbied heavily against any other type of transportation, but besides personal vehicles and gasoline powered vehicles, it's pretty crazy. No, no, Pim, dude. Everyone has bikes, bro. It's just no one commutes on a bike because they have to go so far. So it's like it's just it's just different, you know. just not the it's just it's just it's hard to compare because everything is so spread out here like a 20 minute car commute in the united states is like normal right or or maybe even or maybe even uh preferable craps online hyphy's life is complete stg you know it dude you know it bro Where'd you go, Pim? I want to know where you hit up. Like, what, what, what like, what's a, what's the tourist, uh, you know, checklist for the United States? You go East Coast. You go West Coast. Yeah, we finally got it online, SDG. I've been talking about this forever, forever, and it's finally here. And I, and I like it, dude. And, and I'm actually really, 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 really happy. Uh, so far with the implementation of the game i think it's i think it's a great game and i think that if they take in users feedback on what the actual uh, you know if they take the users feedback of how the game works i think that they'll do uh, a really good job with pe getting people to play this game um so my camera is not working but <laughs> they are uh, i guess they are rolling Here we go. We're back. Any big wins since we started? Um, nothing huge. I actually bought in last night off stream after I torched the, the bankroll. Uh, I bought in for 200, ran it up to six. I ran it up to seven, lost, up, lost down to six, cashed out 200, and then uh, I had 400 today, 365 in the account so uh like last night i don't know i was i was just i was just rage betting on craps and i ran 200 up to 600 and uh, i got my initial deposit the initial deposit out so i didn't record it though or anything i, I was I, I was actually really upset about how i played yesterday but I, we, we i just got stuck on the don't man i got stuck on the don't and it just smoked us on stream and then uh, when I was playing off stream, I was like switching between Iron Cross. I was switching between Don't Comes. I was switching between Pass Line, and I was just running it up. And I just like I ran it up, ran it up, and I got a I got a new bankroll out of, off of my 200, and I got my 200 back. So I'm pretty happy with uh, with how it all worked out. So now we can we I I'll, I'll be better about not doing anything dumb. It's just it's just like when you're when you're betting twenty five dollar don't passes, and you bet twenty five dollar don't comes, and you're getting smoked on it. You're losing like fifty. You're losing like a hundred dollars a roll potentially. So it's like really tough. Like if you hit a bad streak, it's really, really tough. You just keep getting smoked. But you know, that's craps, man. Like if you want to play a certain way and, and, and you're not changing your strategy, like that's how it goes. When the, when the roll is bad, the roll is bad. All right, so that's actually our second hit on nine. So we will actually press this up to 12 because it's a $3 unit. 12 here. Five dollars on the field. We need to hedge with a. We need to hedge with a uh, seven dollar seven here, and if it hits a seven, we have five six twelve out. Five six twelve out. That's a craps. Craps. 
So we lose two dollars on that roll. We get paid on the field, but we lose our seven bet. So we lose two dollars on the roll. Uh, we're gonna put put it back up because no point is set. Put it back up. No point is set. We're hoping for a, a tw we're hoping for an eight here on the come out. We get paid on that twelve dollar eight. Put it right back up. Keep going with the iron cross here. Uh, another two dollar loss. Another another three craps three. The only reason that we're betting this any seven here on the come out roll is because these bets are always working. So we can't take them down. Therefore, we have to hedge them with a bet that we will get paid back if it hits a seven. Because all these are all these are going to come down, but we'll we'll get paid back thirty five dollars on a seven, and we can put this whole board back up, right? So a seven will pay thirty five. So we can we can put up this whole back this whole board back up. Fever five, staying alive. Uh, that's the second time we've hit uh, a five. So we're gonna press this up here and go to a five dollar field still. And hopefully we can keep rolling here, keep this streak going. We have some decent money on the board here. Eights are nice. Five would be nice. Four is fine. I hope you. I hope you guys are having a good day today. I know Mondays can be rough. Bitch, I'm an animal, jungle. We put this shit together, puzzle. I just want to stack my chips like Lay's, Doritos, and Ruffles. Hey, dude. Dusty, Dusty Muskrat underscore just subscribed. Holy shit, 17 months. Holy shit, 17 months is right. And that was a good luck sub. We hit the five, dude. Thank you so much, man. I appreciate that a ton. Thank you, thank you, my dude. Um, I appreciate all your subscriberage. Uh, 17 months is a long time, dude. Over a year. And uh, you love to see it, man. You love to see it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Hope you're having a great day, Dusty. Have you been keeping that sub alive while I've been not been streaming? Because if so, you are crazy, man. Heater coming on. I can feel it. Dr. Day Trip. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I sure hope so. Yo, 11. Of course, I'm a degenerate. <laughs> I love I love you, man. Thank you so much for the 17 months of uh, sub here. Appreciate you. I just want to let you guys know that while I was not streaming for months, I still had 10 sub points. So if, if you were one of those 10 sub points that kept their sub going while I was not streaming, uh, let me know what your PayPal is so I can give you your money back. <laughs> there we go. Nice 750 pays 18 i think that was a collect so we will press the next time we hit this uh we hit this five here rolling the dice hands up dice are out oh man the seven unfortunately but we are up just about eleven dollars here so we're gonna keep our bets working reset our strat here and uh send it out <sighs> keep the bets working send out the strat Uh, summary road trip USA as a duchy. Few days in New York City, then got a flight to LA. Oh wow! 
That's a long flight, dude. Uh, the advice was not to go to the built-up area at all because it's shit. Um, then drove around with a, a large RV for three weeks. Tourist spots. Uh, Las Vegas, Death Valley, Grand Canyon, Monument Valley, Navajo area. Hoover Dam, Yosemite. Dude, that sounds like a great trip, man. Uh, you didn't really hit any of the main cities. And you stayed you, you stayed kind of on the coast, which is which is awesome, dude. Which is awesome. But you saw a lot of, like, that natural beauty kind of, like, just outside the coasts, which is, which is pretty sweet, dude. Uh, nine dollar eight because we just hit that twice. <laughs> you don't have to pay for me, cranky crank. You and Siski been chilly off stream. Yeah, we've been we've been chatting, babe. Siski's Cisco's always my guy, man. Cisco's always my guy, brother. Uh, I've never been to New York City, bro. Yeah, cool, Shakai. Did you hear my story about the balance? Uh, no, start. No, start was three sixty-five. That's a hard six winner winner chicken dinner. Oh, you did. Okay, that's good, bro. That's good. All right, so I'm gonna leave the six off. Um, I'm gonna put the five dollar field down, the five dollar seven that should hedge us, and then as soon as a point is set, I'll bring the six back up just because these bets are always working, so we have to hedge them on the come out, which is so lame, dude. New York City is the cesspool of all states. <laughs> Jeez Louise. All right, we got a decent come out here. Okay, that's right. Um, yeah, you, I don't know, hundred bucks. It's tough, obviously. Um, with this strat on the five dollar table, you're you're in for twenty two dollars a roll. Five and a one, six, six. You're in for twenty two bucks a roll, which means um, we're gonna press this one up to nine here. Which means you could be, you could actually, uh, you could actually play this role for four rollers, pretty much, uh, which is pretty good uh, for craps. I mean, I doubt that like four rollers in a row can go 0.7 out, but you know, you can get unlucky. Like, I mean, I got unlucky last night, and I got unlucky the night before in terms of 0.7 out. So it's like it's always a possibility, you know. Oh, that should have been a nine dollar six, not an eight dollar six. All right, so we collected on the nine. The next one will go to twelve. <sighs> Started driving at fourteen, driving the tractor, driving the tractor around, oh brother. No. Oh, I thought I was out. I thought I was out. Nina, Jesse James, throwing that jizz. Nice win there on the field. If we would have had a pass line, we would have paid a little bit better. Uh, I need to put a little bit more money on the seven here um, to get our five nine nine five back up. But um, hopefully we can hit something here. Six eight would be nice. A little clap. So three craps. We get paid on the field. We lose two bucks. But you know that's the price that you got to pay for hedging that seven there. It's a price you got to pay for hedging the seven. But I've been I've been liking this strategy a lot better because uh, I have noticed that on this little mechanical arm thing that the field is rolled a ton, so you can get lucky off like you know four or five uh, you know field row field uh, rolls in a row. So uh, that's going to go to a $12.6 here because we collected on the 8 and now we're going to press up a unit, a $3 unit uh, since we have the 566 uh, out there. So now we're hoping that we can start rolling some 6s and start rolling some 8s and, and, uh, get, and get that cash out there. 
Oh. Not anymore, my friend. Three and a four, ladies and gentlemen. That's tough. That's uh, tough. They're all on step out. Acts of Terror in Vienna? Is Vienna the name of your bathroom? Or is that your second girlfriend? Hello, Benjamin. Welcome on, Eddie, and I appreciate you hanging out with us tonight. Vienna's a big city in the EU. I know, I know I've been to Vienna. <laughs> <laughs> I've been to Vienna, dude. Come on. <laughs> Thank you, Ian. Thank you. Finally, finally got a laugh at it, Ian. Jeez Louise, it's been rough. It's been rough. Okay, Benji's coming. All right, enjoy. Oh, what's that? Oh, that's funny. Oh, whoa, whoa, hey, everybody, what's going on? New dealer, new stick. <laughs> new stick, new stick. Hey, buddy. We got eight. <laughs> we got eight. 32 of you. Welcome to. Uh, hey, bro. Oh, hey. King of the forest. All right, Dusty. Appreciate you, man. I'll be here. I'll be here. Do, 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 do. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Is your pinky high enough to brag about your roll. EU vacations? Yeah, man. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta tap in. You gotta tap into the. Joking around, Z Pun. You're in the right game. You gotta tap into your ba your parents' bankroll every once in a while. Ladies and gentlemen, we were uh, Chris and I. We were hosts on uh, Brutal. that show for a very long time, and uh, this is a new project we're working on. But you know, you gotta remember where you came from, ladies and gentlemen. I mean, yeah, but now we're crap stealers as well. Crabs dude. Cool. You you went from you went from dealer no deal to crabs. You know, honestly, a, I see uh, that as an absolute win. Uh, two dots, one spot, twenty one winners, ladies and I gentlemen. I see that as an absolute win, my dude. Deal. For a long time players would come and ask us on that show and they'd say, you know, um, do you guys do anything else? And we go, No, we only host the show. Uh, and then now we do something else. So here you go. Uh, let's go see our next roll, ladies and gentlemen. I don't know. If, let's check it out. I don't know if you guys are. Ladies and gentlemen, it is going to be a seven out. Seven. All right. So we hedge the seven out on our working rolls here. Winners. It's a frontline winner seven, actually. Because uh, uh, we haven't established a point yet. So hopefully you're playing the line. If you're playing the line, that's great stuff. We're gonna do I don't think pe I don't think people play deal or no deal. Once they realize that shit was super rigged, they didn't, no one plays it. Terrible game. Hard four, ladies and gentlemen. Terrible game. Twenty-three winners on the four. Mark the four. Four is the new. Mark the four. Four is the new button. Lights are on. Dice are out. Another roll, ladies and gentlemen. Hands are high. Check it out. This is a gorgeous table, ladies and gentlemen. I think it's custom built because it looks a lot different than the tables in Vegas. But I don't know. Uh, yo, 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 11, ladies and gentlemen. Yo, 11. 24 winners on the so we're looking 11. for a nice monster roll right now playing this Iron Cross strategy. Wasn't really a surprise. But, you know. No, Ian, it's so not a bust, dude. Today, this is only uh, only again. available to like three Three-way casinos right now, in. so it really is not I mean, a bust, it dude. It looks like we have quite a few not great rolls, to be honest with you, but hopefully we can cover and get some good rolls. Hard 10, hard 10. 10. No, this guy said he's on dealer, no deal. 28 winners on the 10, congratulations. And we are going to fire the launcher once more, win six. 32, 34 of you on win six. Four, six, and 10 are popular numbers. Let's go check it out. I'm seeing a lot of you are still here though, which is nice. Uh, fiber, fiber, racetrack driver. I like this guy. He has the least thick Latvian accent of them all. So with that, I will say that I do appreciate that. Bet the lose to cover your number. No, I know, that's what I'm saying. Oh, deal or no yeah, deal like, is a bust. Ah, oh, I understand what you're saying now. Yeah, you risky, know, I suppose. If you feel like it's coming, that game in, in, Ladies and gentlemen, in concept, that game seems really good, right? But the way that they implemented, implemented it, ah, shit, dude, I don't know. I don't know. I'm not a huge fan of the way that they implemented it. 
There's but a lot uh, of strategies on crafts. I've been looking into some of them myself because um, I'm curious. I mean, I like to uh, I like to know. You know, I like to understand what's going on. You should. Like, I've been you should. A lot of I like that. Fiber, fiber, racetrack, driver, I like the fact that that guy cares about the about percent. the game that he's dealing. The thing is, is you always in every game you have like all these strategies and, and, and things like in my opinion I mean just play the line I mean <laughs> it's wow not a strategy but if you're lucky you're lucky and you'll win if you'll win and play if you the don't, line. if you think the line is bad play the don'ts I mean it's, it's, it doesn't have to be complicated play six the two don'ts. ladies and gentlemen did we already hit an eight? I think we did, right? So we pressed that up to nine. I believe, ladies and gentlemen, in a good Press this up to nine. I don't know if you believe in a good feeling, but I believe Half if you're unit press something, here? you gotta go for it. Like, if you're feeling the eight, you gotta go for the eight. I mean, I don't know if you, uh, Leon, yeah, I like it, you dude. feel the same way, but. Take the, super, take like the superstitions uh, out of the game. Rule. Let's check it out. By the way. Four, four. Easy. winner four, easy. This is the best song. On the album. <sighs> you know, okay, so so my issue here is right, we have 2750 technically on the board here. I mean, I think we hedge. Um, Let's go see what we got, ladies We think we hedge here. 750, 6, 9, 5 on the field. We have to hedge that with a 7. In my opinion, hard 6. Hard 6. Hard 6. We're going to mark the 6. Nice, uh, hard six. So next six we hit, we will collect, or no, we will press to nine. But we have a five, we have a one unit pressed up on the five, one unit pressed up on the eight, and the field's been hidden. So we do, we're gonna we're gonna do it good. All right, Pim, dude, thank you so much for hanging out. Ladies and gentlemen, fiver, fiver, nice, dude. Thanks for hanging out, bro. I appreciate you. Seven fifty. That's gonna stay there. Uh, we're gonna press that up the next five that we hit here. Uh, you can always check out my vods after the stream. I will leave them up for craps, next and uh, I'm also uploading some crap videos to YouTube. So, might see you there. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, six. I one, can't seven, even five. see the roll. Sure. Twenty-seven winners on the seven. <sighs> All right, I gotta go to the restroom real quick. I'll be right back. I'll let this one come out. Let's go see our next roll, ladies and gentlemen. This is when the guitar kicks in. All right, ladies and gentlemen, five, three, dog in a tree. Mark the eight. Eight is the new point number, ladies and gentlemen. We're gonna fire the launcher, ladies and gentlemen. Take a look and see what we got. Let's check it out. Let's see what we got. Let's take a look. Ladies and gentlemen, six, no field six. 32 winners on the six, congratulations. And we are gonna fire once more, take a look and see what we got, ladies and gentlemen. Let's check it out. Let's see what we got. <laughs> Ian, yeah, thank you. a good roll. I appreciate that. Thank you for your, thank you for your kind words. Ladies and gentlemen, fiber, fiber, race track, fiber. <clears throat> Congratulations. Let's can I get a, one. can I get a buy-in? Can I get a buy-in, please? What we got thank you. On that next roll, Delay the shooter. I'm get ready, a buy. I'm excited. I'm ready to go, ladies and gentlemen. Let's check it out. Let's see what we got. Let's go see what it's gonna be, ladies and gentlemen. Get ready. Let's see see what it's gonna be. Ladies and gentlemen, that's a six. I think this is a, a top number. I think. 32 winners, not bad. An easy six. We're gonna do another roll. Take a look and see what we got, ladies and gentlemen. Make sure those dice are nice and snug in the launcher. Well, let's check it out and see what our next roll is gonna be. Let's find out. Ladies and gentlemen, that is a... Uh, back to back sixes. Four, five, six. 
Four two. Twenty two winners on the six. Congratulations. My gosh, ladies and gentlemen, we'll have some sick. Like if you're if you're playing win six, I mean that's pretty good. Lots of wins on that six. Over here, eight, nine, ten, all. Their five. calls aren't as good as the Vegas so calls, but they do know a few and for sure. We got. They do out. know a couple. Ladies and gentlemen, that is a center field nine. 39 winners on the nine. Congratulations. I do really like the strategy, at least for this website, because it just feels like they do hit a lot of field numbers in between, like hitting points and stuff like that. So I'm I'm a big fan of the strategy so far. Um, but you know, obviously you can get torched if you hit a couple numbers and then you're a couple numbers and then you're done. You know, a couple numbers and then you're done. You can you can uh, you can get rolled pretty quickly. Eight, front line winner eight. Congratulations if you played. Front line winner eight. Winner, that is a nice win here. Oh man, I don't want to hedge, but I will just in case. Five six nine. Five six nine. Take a look and see what we got. Let's check it out. Niner, niner. Twenty five, ladies and gentlemen. Jesse James, mark the nine. Nine is the new point roll. I like that. That's really good for us. Probably one of the better come out rolls that we could have gotten out on that. We only we only lose a two dollar. The stick is got a little bent. As you see, it's, I think it's had some better days. Anyway, next roll. Let's take a look. Ladies and gentlemen, a fiber fiber racetrack driver. Uh, Congratulations. One at 29 winners of the five. We have uh, Messi Wolf saying, what does it mean if you play lose? If you play lose, it means you actually win if there is a... This number. <laughs> um, I love how they don't say it, dude. I love how they don't lose. say it. It's so funny. Okay, I love it. They actually are... Uh, if that is rolled. Uh, they actually... Uh, eight, are respecting the game, uh, you could say, in terms is, of uh, the superstition. Rolled, every single number wins, I think we've rolled an eight like before, so this goes to nine payout. as well. But yeah, I think uh, <clears throat> the payouts are a little different. You can see the payouts somewhere on the left. I forget where it is. Uh, but let's go do uh, another roll. But yeah, you want that number if you do lose. Ladies and gentlemen, it is a seven out seven. So, ladies and gentlemen, Shoot. if you bet lose on this, you win. Congratulations. Shoot. But unfortunately, I don't know if you did. Uh, seven out seven. It's not a great roll for a lot of you. But let's go do another roll. Nice. Did you? I did. Oh, there you go. You won. Congratulations. Yeah, ladies and gentlemen, a lot of you are first time craft players here, which is cool. Uh, just, you know, bet small and learn how to play and, you know, hopefully, uh, you know, you can have a good time. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, we got an eight. Um, you know, Ian, it's it's interesting. I think with anything, really, Mark it's eight. it just depends on how the table is going Easy. while you're betting that strategy. Uh, yeah, I, mean, I mean, obviously, people say that the don't is the best way to make right money, now. and we got Boring we got time. smoked. Uh, we all know it is. So it's a good time to sit we got, down. And we got how to we got we got smoked game. on a don't strategy. I mean, you know, and it's like you and you play. So, you know, enjoy and. I'm sure in a week or two we'll all become professional craps players, and I'll become, ladies and gentlemen, a professional. Uh, I think player. that right now um, you want to do something like this strategy because this is this is my argument for for the Iron Cross, right? So you're limited to one to one odds on, the, on behind the number, right? So you might as well just play this strategy where you win on every number, uh, and you win on that one to one odds. So if you're going to play, potentially play the pass line or play odds or something like that, you'd want to play like a $10 minimum table and do 10, 12, 12, 10 on the field. And then you'd be 55, you'd be exposed for $55 uh, on the initial first roll. And then from there, um, you, you know, you're making $10 a roll, potentially $10 to $4 a roll, as long as you don't crap out. Mr. Crap. No, Cooper. Cranky Crank. I've never, I've never uh, okay. imagined that. No fun. It's unfortunate, ladies and gentlemen. We did get that set. So it did come. We're going to take the line, take the don't come, pay the don't. Last come door now. Pay the don't. Maybe you wanted to come, maybe you shouldn't. That was about it. 
You don't have any questions about one roll bet? Hardware. I am pressing everything. I'm pressing um, field rolls. I'm pressing the five, six, and eight when we hit them twice. Um, potentially, like, I guess a half unit. So uh, I'm pe I'm pressing the five up to seven fifty. I'm pressing the sixes up to nine. Uh, is what I've been doing uh, for this, and it makes it a lot more interesting too. And especially if you get on a hot roll and you get some sixes and eights in a row, you can start building up your bankroll a little bit quicker than just betting like a straight one unit iron cross, which to me just sounds way too grindy, right? Because you potentially need to hit four rolls to break even four rolls to break even five to make profit right but if but if you potentially hit four sixes in a row you'll make uh you'll make what quadruple the amount if you were just playing a flat uh, one unit iron cross in my opinion i don't know if that's statistically true but fire when ready show us what you got Six, three, that makes it nine. 31 winners on the nine, congratulations. What I also was doing yesterday as well is when the table was hot, I was betting the pass line on the come out and then doing the iron cross. So you have a pass line uh, with odds and an iron cross working, uh, which which was working out pretty well when the table was hot. Maybe we can try it today too as well. Gentlemen, it is a seven out seven. Seven table is kind of cold right now. Let's try. Let's try my strategy that I was talking about here. So you bet the pass line, and then uh, then we have our then we do an, our working iron cross as well. So when you hit the number, when you hit uh, when you hit a button. Um, so let's check it out and see we got. Get ready. When you hit the button, you hit you uh, you double down on that, on that on that button winner. Ladies and gentlemen, three craps three. Yo, what up, Gold God, State? What's going on? Take the line, pay the dumps, and the field. What up, brother? For a run now, I agree. Should we go? Should I, should I do a joke where I like run? Yeah, I agree. Let's uh, let's hope we can get. I got that last going. second hedge there on the C and E. I <laughs> got our money back there on that crap out. That number, it's all about just getting those wins in. Let's check it out. They've got the three and the five. That's an eight. It's a great. So number, this is pretty actually. good for our strategy here. In my opinion, on your side. Uh, we're gonna mark if you wanted to, you could take odds. I'm not going to, but I'm just going to put our iron cross up and uh, really go from there. Point number to be on. So it looks like the eight's so going to pay 33 if it hits an eight here. 33 to hit an eight. That's like what you want with the point number. All right, next roll. Let's check it out. Ladies and gentlemen, it is unfortunately. Mm, this is when it gets. This is when it gets precarious. Nineteen winners on the seven. That's the end of the line. Ah, see, this is when you're you're in trouble. You're in trouble. We are gonna do another roll and check out. We got pass line, win eight, win six, win nine, and over there is eleven, uh, nine, eleven, nine, and eight. Let's go do another roll and check it out. We got a uh, hard six there. We are going to mark the six. That is the new point rule. And we are going to place that in the launcher and fire away. Take I really like it too. Yeah, it shows you everything. It shows you every number that you can win and what potentially your winnings are. I think that's a really, really cool option, for, especially for people that are new to craps. Seven out seven. Wow. Seven See, if we were betting the don'ts five, here. <sighs> if we were betting the don'ts, uh, we would be straight. doing really, really well. Unfortunately, we are not. We well, are betting the Iron Cross. And check it out. Maybe we'll get a win. We're I, I'm always on the opposite side of how the dice are rolling, dude. Go, still going for the line, <laughs> it always so. goes like that. Let's check it out. Let's see what we got. We got a uh, Fiber Fiber Racetrack Driver. No, because I deviated last night and I got smoked right for everything. So I mean, hopefully we can we can get something going here. Maybe get a monster roll. Maybe get some presses up and uh, keep keep making some money. Some twos, some twelves. Get some get something going here. But a point seven out would be would be a nightmare. Ladies and gentlemen, that's really good for us. Online, winner five. Congratulations. Played the line. Twelve of you won. 
on the line. Congratulations, you knew. You knew. I was a little skeptical, I'll be honest. But I was skeptical for you playing the line. But you played the line, you won. So congratulations. I know nothing. Well. It's time hey, to what's up, AFK? What's going on, brother? Check it out and see what we got. We're not up, actually. We're not up. Hard four, ladies and gentlemen. Twelve winners on the four. Congratulations, Mark. The four. Hey, what's up, GP? What's going on, man? How are you doing today? I didn't know you were live. I sent and out a Discord so notification. Ladies and gentlemen, let's check it out. Ladies and gentlemen, four. Bang, 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 bang. Yes. Back to back buttons. Winners on the four. Congratulations. That's a nice, very nice double, double down here. Once more, ladies and gentlemen, take a look and see what we got. Beautiful. They work on the come out. You can't take them down. Check it out. Seven out seven. Okay, so we perfectly hedged, right? We perfectly well, hedged. We got all of our money back. Damn, son. Where'd you, you find this? Yo, B. Parles, thank you so much. Oh, we got all of our money back. $10 here. But if you are playing the line, that is a win for the line, which is great. Let's do another rule. And see what we got, ladies and gentlemen. Check it out. Damn, son, where'd you find this? Yo, Barton, thank you so much. Ladies and gentlemen, seven winners, seven. If you're playing the line, that is another win. Fifteen winners on the there line. There we go. Bitch, I'm an animal, junk. We put this shit together, puzzle. I just want to stack my chips like Lay's, Doritos, and Ruffles. I see a lot of you going for the junk <laughs> pass this time. Thank you so I much. Up, Thank you so much, bro. I appreciate so you. Uh, what side am I on? I am on. If you want to use my affiliate code, you can do exclamation point site. Exclamation point site. Well, it is going to be a hard, hard six. six. Hard Not six. A field rule. Just a hard six. We're going to mark the six. That is the new number there. Hard six. We made little, made like fifty bucks off those hedges, actually. I'm very, uh, 17 I months of total today, subscriber age. Thank you so much, GEP, dude. Energy. No, they don't have so they don't have craps energy. yet, but uh, just yeah. hold on, and I swear three. they'll get the craps. So just make an account, deposit in there, and just wait because it's gonna come very very soon, my dude, and it'll be the best time ever. Let's go fire the launcher, ladies and gentlemen, and we are gonna take a look, and of course. See what we get. Um, I mean, we've been doing pretty good. There's no all point at all, Ian, where you can take a bet that. down at this moment. But like I said, nine, not terrible. I mean, this is not sportsbet.io. Uh, uh, like I said, that there's been a lot of users in chat complaining about how you can't take bets down. And the, since this is a soft release to very few casinos, they may implement that feature. So uh, maybe if you guys want to complain about it a little bit more. And check it out. What do we got? Oh, uh, dang, B. Parles. Make a new account under my name, dude. Ladies and gentlemen, it is a six. Six winner, pass line winner, and up top. Let's go, baby. Number, number. Uh, yeah, ladies and gentlemen, I figured we'd So, like I said, this pass line iron cross strat does sometimes uh, pay, pay out. I think you were feeling as well. That's why so many of you played it. And we're gonna do another roll now. Let's check it out. See what we got. Thirty-five completely hedges all of our bets on the table. Ladies and gentlemen, four easy four. Stakes getting it on the eighth, from what you hear. I did not hear that. They didn't tell me that at all. But that's pretty cool. Yeah, the eighth is the eighth would be great. Lamont's on. This is an iron cross strategy. Um, uh, right now sure is probably the best strategy that you can play on this rule set of craps just because uh, there's one to one odds behind. Ladies and gentlemen, craps 12. 10 winners. We're going to double the field. Congratulations. And it's a great roll. You got to flirt with Danica to get that kind of info, dude. Shit, Ian, you flirt with Danica? Come on, dude. Mr. Launcher, give us. A good roll. Give us a 3 1 winner winner here. Would love to see it. Oh, no. no. 
seven. No. Seven there you go. Sixteen winners on the seven. One of you was playing the dunks there pretty big. Congratulations. But, uh, you know, not the best situation for most players. Unless you're only playing the dunks. You got win eight, win five, win six, all very popular. You know a guy with clout that plays with them? Oh, okay, okay. For sure, nine. for sure. And our next roll. Check it out. We got a 45. 18 winners. Mark the nine. Damn, son. Where'd you find this? Yo, Casa Rico. Thank you so much for the follow, man. Appreciate you hanging out with us tonight. They swap. I've seen them swap them out once. It seems to be like once a day. I, I, I can't tell really. Four, easy four. Hey, there was that three one four. We were looking for that last round. We were looking for that last round. Come on, man. And we are going to do another roll, ladies and gentlemen, and check it out. See what we got. Hopefully, it's going to be something good. They weren't balanced. What the fuck? Ladies and gentlemen, it is a fiver, fiver, race track, driver, 18 winners on the five. Dotson comes to the five. Down behind the five. Can you kiss the dice? Yeah, you can kiss it through your computer screen. But if you look over here, nine is our top number. Anorax, uh, I heard that they have heard a lot of feedback on terms of not taking down bets. I'm ready to go. Not taking down bets. So if you give them feedback on the odds and behind, and the there we go. Line. That's a nice clappus. A nice clappus. If you if you give them feedback on the odds behind, maybe they'll change that as well. Well, ladies and gentlemen, this will be our new come out roll. We won. We did it. Nice. We hit the freaking nine, dude. Nina from. Thumbs up. Thumbs up, ladies and gentlemen. Six two. It's a gift for you. Six two. Twenty one winners. We'll take that there. Beautiful. Uh, I'm not gonna take odds behind because this is technically our odds behind right here. Uh, if we hit it, we'll press it. Uh, if we hit five, we'll press. We haven't hit a six yet. Let's keep it rolling, boys. Let's get a good one here. No, that's not what we want to see after the pass line comes out. Oh, Fire the launcher, ladies and gentlemen. Take a look and see what we got. See what we got. Three craps three. If you played the three craps three, we actually we hedged that, so we're okay. And the field. Congratulations. To pay. Field to pay. I don't know. Uh, Lamont's on because well. I'm just doing like some hybrid fucking iron cross strategy. It's really like it's no, there's no like there's no like science behind it or anything like that. So, like, when the button goes to eight now, I'm still going to put up my full iron cross. Mark the eight, ladies and gentlemen. But what you're saying is I should do this. Mr. Launcher, aim for that alligator skin right there, please. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, hard six. 21 winners on the six. Congratulations. He told the launcher to hit the wall, dude. Short roll. Why you call? Oh, why you call a short roll? Why you call a short roll? Um, you can say it, but I mean, people are so fucking superstitious about that dumb shit that like people get buttered because when they think that you say it out loud it will show up that's that's the main issue right when they think that like they're like oh you said it so it showed up that's that's the only reason why you can say whatever the fuck you want dude there's no there's no like rules against it is spooky it is spooky ladies and gentlemen 
by three. That is a winner. Pass line. Pass line. Winner. Uh, what do I need to... So, ladies and gentlemen, we're doing pretty good. We're getting some wins. We're getting some not wins. Hedge with the seven here. I don't here. know. Let's go see what we got. I have no idea what it's going to be. Max odds they offer behind are um, one X. <laughs> one X odds. One X odds behind. A lot of you going for the comeback. Win nine and the pass line. As well, we've got six, ten, and nine as our top number. That means we got a eight. Have we hit an eight yet? Nineteen winners on the eight. Congratulations. Is this a press on the eight? I'm not sure. I mean, I guess I'll just leave it out there. Fire the launcher once more. And see the process on the one X. I don't know. I mean, I mean. The the thing is, isn't that the, I mean, the odds is the best bet in the book, right? Ladies and gentlemen, that is a four. Taking max odds is the best bet in the book. Three it it, it the is what Three they say. The uh, maybe they thought that they were going to somehow be Mr. like too exposed. Fire away, Mr. Launcher. Show us what you got. Give us a roll. No, because the reason I'm betting the five on the odds is because I would have bet the five on the five here. Show us what you have. Ladies and gentlemen, it is a center field nine. 27 winners on the nine. Beautiful. That's this thing. We are going to fire the launcher once more. Five pays 3250 at this moment so in time. The five pays thirty two fifty at this moment, cause ladies and gentlemen, that is a ten. Twenty four winners on the ten. Congratulations, Johnson comes to the ten. Down behind the ten. Make sure the puck is nice and neat. I'm gonna step back because we got another roll. Check it out and see what we got. Who's the shooter? The me the mechanical arm. Hard four, ladies and gentlemen. He's always the shooter. <laughs> Twenty-four winners on the board. The mechanical arm is always the shooter. And we are going to do another roll. I have seen a lot of hard fours come out on this table. A lot of hard Sorry, fours and a lot of midnights. Go. No, Gold State, I've never done that. I don't care enough to shoot that much. Seven out. Seven, seven out. out. Seven. Six, one. Seven no out. Fun. That's seven that, out. Ladies seven. and gentlemen, you know, not the best situation, I think. I was hoping we would get a... Let's, go, let's come off the pass line for a bit. Pass line. Well, we got another roll coming in. And we are going to check it out. Let's go see what that roll is going to be. Uh, Lamonson, no, they pay you the full amount here. Yeah, it's a, it's a computer that that's like you know delegating the payouts. So it's a it it's a completely uh completely uh you know no bias or whatever. The computer just pays it out. It it, it calculates the odds and it pays it out. It's not it's not too hard. Wouldn't it be fairly safe to bet big on the field? No, it's actually a negative EV bet. I'm excited. I'm ready. What's it going to be? Ladies and gentlemen, 6 4. Slam the door. 22 winners on the 10. Congratulations. Sports bet has craps. Just checked. Oh, nice, dude. Very, very, very cool. But if you are under my link or you're going to use my link, the 8th is when it's going to be released. So just six days away. Let's take a look and see if that next goal is going to be. Ready. Ian, do you want to come play with me? Four, easy four. 21 winners on the four, congratulations. The field's a negative EV bet because you lose on the six, seven, and eight. The five, six, seven, and eight, excuse me. So you lose on, you lose on the four most common numbers, right? So, like, if you look at it like a chart of uh, the possible outcomes of a dice. 
Ladies and gentlemen, 6 1, no fun, 7 out of 7. 16 ways to win, 20 ways to lose. Thank you, GEP. That's what I was trying to explain. I appreciate that. 16 ways to win, 20 ways to lose, negative EV bet. But you do get paid double on the 2 and the 12, so I mean, there is some way to get some uh, some edge back there, but not much. Like Lay's the Riddle and Ruffles. <laughs> Kevin, Kevin Eight just subscribed. Hi Fay Pog, hi Fay Pog, hi Fay Pog. Hi Fay Pog, hi Fay Pog, hi Fay Pog. Thank you so much, bro. Appreciate the uh, the subscriber uh, subscribing, man. Thank you. Eight months, dude. We got an eight over here as our point. If two and twelve pay triple, then it's actually zero percent. You mean if two pays double and twelve pays triple? Ladies and gentlemen, four, three dots, one. Spot. What'd you say? Winners on the board there. Nice, nice. Can you win? We are gonna do our next game. What? Win six, win five, do win what? nine. Over here. No, eight, no, no, four, no. Six, I don't have a camera. Kind of what you expect on our top numbers. What? Do another roll and check out and see what we got. I couldn't hear you. You were mumbling. Ladies and gentlemen, that is a forty-five. Jesse James. 24 winners on the nine. Congratulations. Oh, if both pay triple, it's zero percent. One of them paying triple is 2.7 ish percent, and both is 5.5 percent. I mean, a 2.7 percent house edge on a bed, it's actually, you know, pretty decent, right? Ladies and gentlemen, oh, seven out of seven. Dude. 23 winners on the seven. Nothing wrong with a field bet. Just double the bet until it hits. <laughs> I, I want to try that one day, actually. We should totally try the Martingale on the field strategy when we have when we have more money. Would it be like 5, 10, 20, 40, 80? I mean, shit, man. That, I mean, it could get expensive real quick, though. How many of you wanted that? 14 of you won on that 10. It's a field roll and it's a great bet as well. Congratulations. Hard 10. Hard 10. One dollar hard 10. One dollar hard 10. Win five. 13 of you on it. 10 is the top number. Because it is our point. It's also a field roll. We've got a fiver, fiver, FIBA five. 15 winners on the five. Congratulations. Now we're going to fire our friend the launcher, ladies and gentlemen, and take a look and see what that next roll is. You do Martin Gale on the field all the time? We got, just, I mean, I, I mean, even if you start at 10, it gets expensive. 10, 20, 40, 80, 160. Ladies and gentlemen, center field nine. So it's like you don't have you don't even have that much room in reality to uh, even you know keep it going, dude. Because I've seen I've seen a six I've seen a six 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 eight seven before. If you're on the rule if you're on the if you're on the field on a on a bet like a six 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 eight seven, dude, you're fucked. Ladies and gentlemen, we got yo 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 eleven. Yo, 11, 16 winners on the Yo, 11. Thank you very much. We're gonna fire away, ladies and gentlemen. It's a good roll. Yo, 11's a good roll. A lot of players win. A lot of players play the come bet. A lot of players win on the come. Uh, let's go see that next two dollar one, Two dollar craps in East St. Louis. Thanks. Two dollar, so, so if, you did, if you did a Martingale on the field. Three, six, center field nine. 21 winners on the nine. Dude, seriously. I mean, no Martingale strategy is ever a good strategy <laughs> when it comes down to it. I mean, <laughs> I like this strategy because statistically you have a pretty good chance of staying alive, right? On a good roll, you're going to make money. On a bad roll, you lose. But, like, statistically, you should do okay in, in, in the end. Um, I'm okay right now. Thank you, though. 
That's two fives. Yeah, no, Teddy, I agree with you 100%, but last night I did, I bet the don't pass, don't come, and I lost 700. So, it's pretty funny. It's pretty funny how that works. <laughs> Is that the second eight or the first eight we've hit? I, I don't even remember. I'm gonna keep it at six dollars. We are gonna fire that launcher. No ten yet, and we have uh, have quite a few rolls. GP, did Table's you delete the Trump support? Right it's a little bit warm. I'm not gonna lie, but we're gonna do that next roll. Check it out. Ladies and gentlemen, it is gonna be five three. Cat stuck in a tree. Nineteen winners on the eight. Yeah, B Parles, of course. I mean, it, like I said, it really just depends on, you know, how the table is. The table. Yes, Lamonson, that's the whole point. The whole point of an Iron Cross is you make $2 on a 6 and 8. You make $2 on a 5. Oh, no, I didn't bet field. Oh, thank goodness. The, uh, have, you ever, have you ever heard of an Iron Cross strategy, Lamonson? That's what that, that's the whole point of it. Okay, you guys, this is getting into some like it's getting into some blackjack theory crafting shit, boys. Dude, it's it's dice. Anything can be rolled at any time, right? So technically a five could be rolled five, ten, eleven times in a row. But the odds of that happening are very low. Just like how you're saying a field bet could be rolled one in every four rolls, but maybe one time a field bet gets rolled one in every eight rolls, and then your 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 Martingale strategy <laughs> has now been eight X'd and you're and now you're betting a field bet for five hundred dollars to win five dollars. It's dumb. That's my point. Like you're you're trying to like use statistics to prove your point, but you're using a statistic to actually disprove your point. <clears throat> but that's not the point of tonight anyway. Uh, we're playing a iron cross strategy for $150. So can you guys just chill? <laughs> can you guys just chill and enjoy the iron cross strategy? <laughs> like, like just, just, let's just have a good time. Let's just enjoy the stream. And dude, you got some smooth jazz in the background. We're chilling, boys. We're chilling, dude. No problem. You guys are Gucci. This is not like how you should play craps optimally. This is what an iron cross strategy can do for you if you ever went to a table and potentially played with real money. What's the best bet where all the outcomes hit before a seven? Uh, probably an all tall small or a fire bet, but those are licensed bets um, that are not offered uh, on an online casino at this moment. Maybe, maybe if Evolution got fire bets, that'd be pretty freaking sweet, actually. Hey, 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 Teddy, come on, bro. No, no, don't ban him. There is no rebet function because bets come down after every win. The bets come down after every win. I think, unfortunately, a European coding this game. I don't give a shit. I don't give a shit. No, B Parles, we're not. I, dude, honestly, this is the chillest fucking chat. Dude, there's no like resentment or anything. We're all chilling. I'm just trying to explain how we're playing the game at this moment but there's also other there's also other ways to play the game this game is very complicated in terms of like what side you can be on what you want to bet on it's it, it, you know what i mean it's 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 more complicated you know
Rock 7. Thanks. It'd be a fucking sleeper stream if you just did pass line with max odds only. Well, dude, max odds on this website is one to one. <laughs> so yeah, it'd be fucking sleeper for sure. You'd be fucking snoozing all day, dude. So many ways to bet. Where'd you find this? Cool. And right there. Thank you so much for the uh, for the follow, man. I appreciate that. Welcome on in. Hope you're having a great day. Yo, Teddy, thank you so much uh, for for chatting, bro. But uh, you got a little timeout. You're 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 allowed to chat again. No one's really arguing with anybody, bro. It's really not like that here. We all love each other. Wouldn't it make it uh, worth it to do the Iron Cross then, since the pass line is dog shit? Yeah, exactly. I mean, that's why. That's exactly why, in my opinion. Uh, right now, if you're looking to play any type of place bets, the Iron Cross is the best strategy. Uh, just because the one-to-one -one odds are garbage. Um, you know, if you hit a hot roll, at least you're getting, at least you're pressing your bets up on on the five, six, eight. At least you're, you know, making money. F y'all. Okay, you want to go back to timeout, bro? Come on, we're chilling. We're chilling, dude. And you're getting butt hurt about some dumb shit. Fucking go drink a beer, bro. Chill out. Come back. Smoke a cigarette. What the fuck are you doing, dude? Agreed. Agreed, he checked. Honestly, this is like the most civil chat in on Twitch for the most part. And this dude is fucking getting butthurt about some dumb shit. So, I mean, right now, I mean, the don't would be really good, right? On Especially on, like, some point seven outs and shit like that. But, you know. Come odds are one-to-one -one as well, yeah. I mean, honestly, though, there has been some monster rolls that I've witnessed so far on this, on this online shit. So I mean, like the don't, the don't, sometimes is just not worth it in my opinion. The don't can just be so nasty because you can get screwed. But you know, when the dice are cold, the dice are cold. Um, no, it's five percent vig. We 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 uh, we managed to figure out that it's five percent vig. I don't know what it is in a real casino. Uh, I'm not even sure, but um, I think I think the uh, five percent seems pretty pretty normal. All right, and right there's number five. So, boom, 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 boom. Down behind five, and if you're five, then you come to the five. So we'll look at what we got next. Jump on in, bet those once again, guys. Five percent standard. That's what that's what casinos charge. Okay, thanks, GP. Yeah, I mean five percent five percent didn't sound too bad, in my opinion. Um, GEP Vicious V says, Hola, señorita, ¿cómo estás? No, no, I said that's what you said. Oh, yeah, hola, hola, señor. ¿Cómo estás? <laughs> he said, I'm not coming to visit. Have a good life. What? <laughs> Soon. At some point. When COVID's over, he'll come. He said, Muy bien, mi amiga. ¿Y tú? He said he can't type in Spanish. She said, Como estas? 
<laughs> I'm just kidding. She said, I'm doing well. Thank you. Congrats on passing Spanish one. <laughs> oh, man. No, someone else said that. As someone dating a Mexican, Hyphy speaks more Spanish than I do. I date a Mexican, too. And it's like, dude, she like I keep telling her, I'm like, babe, I can't eat rice and beans anymore. I'm farting every day. I'm like, ay, ay, ay. <laughs> Mariachi is sick. Mariachi is sick, dude. All right, we've got the next seven. So we turn the lights off. We pay the. I'll trade you rice and beans for some fire Asian food. Let's go, GP. Come on, you gotta, you gotta put that shit in a in a vacuum pack and bring it all over, dude. I need. I know that your roommates are Chinese, but I'm really feeling some lumpia. If someone can, if someone can send me some some fire lumpia, I'll be down. I know. I said that. If someone can send me some fire lumpia, let me know. I'm gonna go to the restroom real quick. I'll be right back. Yeah, I did. So down behind. Yes. 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 They don't let you see everyone else that's on the board. You can't hear other people's cheering or booing. They switch cameras between each roll. To me, that means they should be showing... They could be showing pre... Oh, come on, prodigal. Come on, prodigal. Pre-recorded video. Come on, prodigal. Watch this, bro. Watch this. See we got low fee saying hey dealer let's get some hot rolls. I hope they're not too hot because I'll burn my hands, you know? Like, ah, ah. Oh, we got all right, number nine. So Mark Come on bro. Nine, we'll Come on. Play the field and this goes on the Don't be don't <laughs> Don't be like that, bro. It's a fucking online game. It's been certified from the authorities, dude. Like, let's just chill out. Let's have a good time. Let's play some fucking craps here, dude. Like, dude, come on. The ev evolution. Okay, can I just mute this real quick? Evolution is a publicly traded company on the Swedish stock market. 
this company is fully certified, fully regulated. So don't come in here with this, with this, it's rigged stuff, dude. Honestly, it, it's not a good look. And if you think that it's rigged, if you honestly think that it's rigged, why don't you just put your whole life savings into evolution stock? Because you'd be rich. If it's rigged, you'd be rich, bro. All right, we have the number four hard four. So down behind the four, they field four, let's jump to the four. Sweet. Carry on, who you got next? Rock and roller, guys. Fair say, can make bets. Let's do this crack a lapin, won't we? Let's do this. Fire away. Why don't you log into your brokerage account, go to the Swedish Stock Exchange, buy Evolution stock, and then you'll be fine, bro. Life is good. Then you're going to be on the rigged side of a rigged casino. And technically, you can't lose, right? You can't lose. You're going to be making money by having stock in a rigged casino. Okay, come on, 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 come on. I never thought that I would have to defend a robotic arm throwing two dice at a fucking wall against being rigged, bro. Come on, guys, dude, are you serious? I just don't understand how we got to this point in our lives. Oh my god, Prodigal, if you have a problem with the game, don't watch, and and don't play. I mean, I mean, come on, bro. Have you ever been to a real craps table before? I've seen 6.7 outs from a human arm, and I lost $300 in 10 minutes. Okay? I've lost $300 in 10 minutes. The quickest $300 I've ever lost was playing craps. I can't even lose $300 in 10 minutes playing blackjack, okay? So the fact that you're even trying to trying to Damn, say... Damn, uh, son, where'd you find this? I don't even want to talk about it. Yo, Too Fat and Matt, thank you so much for the follow, bro. Oh, You could almost you could almost prove a point that a robotic arm throwing the dice is actually better odds than a human throwing it. You could make you could make that argument and probably be right. So I don't even want to hear the rig stuff. I'm just having a, I'm just trying to have a good time playing the fucking Iron Cross and maybe getting a monster roll. Okay, that's all I want to do. I'm playing fucking twenty two dollars a hand, pretty much. And I have to defend. We gotta def we gotta defend why we think a robotic arm is rigged or not rigged. I just don't want to talk about it. Can we please change the subject? Can we just have fun, like hanging out and and watching some dice being thrown? That's all. That's all I want. <laughs> if I didn't have a job, I'd be a professional. So true. So true. Back to back eights, right? Whoa, man. Jeez Louise. Um, no, okay. What's the iron cross strat? It's a uh, you place the five, six, eight, and you play the field. Shall we? 
Indeed. These guys. Hold on one second. I'm a summary professional gambler too. I watch Hyphy on Twitch. Thank you, bro. Hyphy taught me proper blackjack strategy. No troll. Thanks, man. I appreciate that. Um, no, young end. It doesn't work like that because um, your bets stay on the board. Even like these are continuous bets, right? These these bets are continuous bets. So the five, six, and nine will stay up forever unless a seven is rolled. Or a six or a five six eight is rolled. So they'll stay up the whole time. So I'm betting I'm risking twenty five on a chance to win on every number except the seven. Cool. But my squad, my squad, I'm down for my squad. My squad. I care about no problem. I only But uh these five, six, and nine stay up on every roll. Hypey only teaches the never cash out. I cashed out last night. Come on. Just made a fuego dinner. We back. Right. No way, Jose. That was off stream. Yo, what's up, Geography? Thank you so much for the uh, host, uh, host to Reno. Appreciate that, man. <laughs> 300 hours. To 400, 400 hours. <laughs> oh, man. 400 hours. All right, you guys, we need a monster roll. We need a monster roll. I'm expecting a monster roll coming up soon. I love when it hits a bunch of sevens on the come out because I just feel like a monster roll is going to come up after that. I need a monster, monster roll. I want a monster, monster, monster roll. Monster, monster roll. I want a monster, monster, monster roll. Monster, monster, monster. I want a monster, monster, monster roll. Let's go, boys. Let's get some good luck. Can I get some good luck in the in the in the chat here? Can I get some good luck subs? Good luck subs. Good luck chats. Good luck biddies. Monster, monster roll. I want a monster, monster, monster roll. For that roll, Kappa. <sighs> there we go. That's, that's what we like to see. That's what we like to see. Good luck. Good luck here. It's a nine dollar eight. Nine dollar eight. Let's go. Let's get some. Let's get some eight action in here. Pass line would be a win on a 10, yes. A field bet is a one roll bet. A field bet is a one roll bet. A 10 will win a 10, will win a 10, will win, win, win a 10. We have to hedge with a 7 here, unfortunately, because we have 5, 6, 9 out on the board right now. No, the man, no, the ten, the ten paid us ten. It's fine. The ten paid us, uh, paid us five. Excuse me. All right, 
11. Yo, 11. Right. Yo, 11. The 10 was fine. The 10 was fine. Six, six, easy six. So mark the six. Have a little go. Jump on in, best open, guys. I think that was the first six we hit, actually. Need a monster roll. Good luck, biddies from Heat Check. Here we go. Two or twelve would be nice. Eight's good. Eight's good. <laughs> There we go. Five biddies from AFK. Let's go. Five biddies. Good luck, biddies here. Next one's going to be a pressed 12 on the 8. Can I say something about equity? Um, is it a fade? Is it a fade comment? If it's a fade comment, I'd wait till after we are on a new come out. About the hop. Sure. What do you got to say about the hop? Oh, the hop on the come out. Okay. What's the hop on the come out? What do you, what do you got on the hop on the come out? You, you're losing quite a bit of money on it. Uh, the only unfortunate thing is the 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 bets on the top are always working. Right. The bets on the top are always working. So technically, the hedge is there to save our bets up top. So this is going to be a nine dollar nine right here, right? So we got a nine dollar six, excuse me, nine dollar six with a field bet. We would need seven dollars to hedge all this up top. Fire away, guys. Buffy, Vampire Slayer, how are you? If we hit a field bet, we pay. We if we hit a field bet, especially Snake Eyes, we pay for that and some. The only reason is because these are these bets are working right here, right? So we have to hedge it at some point. Dusty, thank you so much for the good luck biddies. This is going to be a monster roll. I feel it. I feel it. So look, we only lose $2 on this bet, right? We hedge the come out on all of our money up top, and now the button's on 9, and now we can keep back into our strat. Th does that make sense, or am I missing something here? It wouldn't let GEP watch an ad for bit, so these are from him too. Oh, GEP, thank you so much, bro. I appreciate that. I'm feeling, I'm feeling lucky. There wasn't any matches to add. <laughs> I love that. George the Rock? The, the hockey player? George the Rock, the hockey player? Dude, that's fucking wild. There's gonna be two geriatric motherfuckers with oxygen tanks fighting in the ring. Let's do this. Let's go. Fire away. 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 Fire away
find out. Oh. What will happen next? We'll find out and carry on that plan this way, won't we? So, so we I always have. Winner! Alright, so you're saying that I should hedge less on the 7 here. So we got our money back for those bets on the table. We're gonna leave it at And we have the number four. So mark four. Until point gets set. Okay, the field. Four ball. And we carry on. And then we go. There we go. That's what we got next. Bets open, of course. Jump on this bet. See what we got in the game. And see us crack a lap and do this. Lock and roll. We need a monster roll, boys. Monster roll. Let's go. Twos and twelves all day. Let's get back up to three hundred. Let's get back up to three fifty. Fire away. Let's go. Monster roll, boys. Three fifty. It is. All right, the number seven. Okay, we turn the lights on. Okay, the don'ts take the line. A C and E bet is two, three, eleven, and twelve. As you can see right there, we've got the uh, number six. So, down behind the six, now we see a six. Whoop, whoop, whoop. There she comes to the six. Alright. Carry on, see what we got next. <laughs> the Let's opposite see. of monster. And then what's going to this goal? So, let's have a look and see what we got in the game, shall we? Let's do this. Onwards. Let's go. Let's see what we got in the game. Onwards. Yeah, no. Onwards we go. Next roll, two, snake eyes. And we have the nine. On the yeah. sets, on the on the dice sets, I'm not looking for anything honestly because we're playing the we're playing the uh, iron cross strat. So uh, no matter what the set comes out, it doesn't really matter as long as it hits one of our numbers, right? Because we can't lose unless it's one number. We can't lose unless it's the one number that comes out that makes right, us lose. So the sets I don't really care about. Um, I mean, in terms of like actually studying dice sets and like understanding like what numbers might come out when it hits, like I don't know. Down this will shake the sports world. Breaking news. The A-League, formerly known as the Hyundai A-League, has just lost its name sponsor, Hyundai, despite signing a two-year extension with the league. This announcement comes as a surprise to most because it was accidentally revealed after the A-League was forced to remove all Hyundai affiliation on social media. The news is coming before an official announcement. Stand by for more info. Do, 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 do. This was breaking news by Ian. Number five. 
Ian Vicious B says hello. How do you do? And welcome to the stream. <laughs> Z, dude, Z, that's so fucking funny. Oh, seven out, dude. Unbelievable. What? Not yet, yeah, no. Alright, I'm gonna play the pass line here. Right, let's do ten dollar unit here. Ten dollar unit. Ten dollar unit. Ten dollar unit, boys. Ten dollar unit. Let's go. Fire away. Oh, except I, except I left a five dollar unit on the field. Hello, so glad you could join us, V. Is your Halloween costume supposed to be my family? Because you clearly abandoned us and are now trying to come back around the holidays. She said that's very sad. That's not what she was trying to do. Hmm? She's looking at Bull Massive videos. She says she doesn't give a fuck about your family. She ain't gonna give a fuck about your family. Your family. Three craps, three. Three craps, three. AC Deucey, three craps, three. Hi, v is the girlfriend that Hyphy says we wouldn't know because she goes to another school. Hello, can you hear her behind me? You know that's false, Ian. Come on. Three one easy four three one easy four through the door. He said he thought that voice was God. Hello, God. God's a woman. Yeah, he's not sexist. Yeah. Hard eight. Hard eight. Welcome to the place. Hard eight. Hard eight. Welcome to the place. That's a box car. Midnight, twelve pace thirty on the field. Welcome back to the party, brother. Monster roll here, boys. Monster roll here, boys. I'm feeling a good one. Four five Nina. Four five Nina. Sixer, sixer, sixer will work. Sixer will work. What's up, babe? Oh. Uh, I actually went to like, I think I went to the D and the D pays triple on the 12, I think. From what I remember, the D pays triple. We know you like the D, babe. Jeez Louise. Oh, the casino. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I thought you were talking about something else. Who would have thought? You would have thought. Who would have thought, babe? Who would have thought? Who would have thunk it? 
Come on, can I get a four or five Nina? Four or five Nina from Pasadena. Sixer, sixer, winner, winner, sixer. What? Yeah. Eighteen dollar six, one unit press. Let's go. Let's keep it running, boys. Sixer, sixer, seventy dollars total on the board. Stickman replaced. Let's get a good roll here. Good roll. Good luck roll. Sixer. No, the stick man. Dealer change seven out. Of course. Of course. You meant she likes the penis. You like the penis. Eight, easy eight. Uh, I'm feeling risky, boys. I'm feeling risky. Let's go. Let's get some action on the. Can we get? A, can we ask for a new arm? Yeah, absolutely. Any day, any day, any any day of the week. New arm, new life. Fiver. Fiver. Election day is tomorrow, babe. Thank you. Fiver, 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 fiver. I want to see the oil can. Give me, give me the oil can. Let me know that. Let me know that arm is well lubed. Three craps, three field pays for the cum. No money. But we're going for it all, boys. We're going for it all. V is a political activist. Absolutely. No odds on the five? Uh, maybe in a second. Snakes! Snakes! No, that was that was Ian. We'll do the odds now that we won the snakes. Babe, they heard you say that you the that I don't pay you for the cum, so can you please stop talking about that stuff? No way ho Try a little don't come here. Just one round of don't come, then go back right back on the pass. One round of don't pass, right back on the pass. Ooh, I didn't hedge that. I did not hedge that. Did not hedge that. Unfortunately, no hedgy wedgy. What was I thinking? I don't know. I just wasn't thinking about it. Watch this being an 11. Oh, I didn't hedge it again. Unbelievable. No hedgies. No hedgy wedgies. Don't come. No, it's, we're on the don't pass right now because the point's not set. No hedges. The life is hard. Six and a two. Oof. Yikes. Best of luck, Jimmy. <clears throat> Hello, one and a one, ladies and gents. 
to Boston, Illinois. Congrats, sir. Ready, ladies and gents. Ace Yeah, that's been pretty fast. Yeah, that's coming in like 730, 730, well done. That's open, ladies and gents. Damn, son, where'd you find this? Yo, what's up, Wilf? Thank you so much for the follow, man. Appreciate you. He's a deer hunter. Yo 11 actually pays us pretty good. $32. Nice little clap there. Pays us pretty good. Uh, yes, yes, yes. Pays us pretty good. Yo 11 pays us nice. It's not on Rubet yet. Not on Rubet just yet, my dude. No way, Jose. It's not on Rubet. No, 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 it's not. Big Red, please. Big Red, please. Big red, please. Here we go. We are in full desperato mode. Desperato Madalo. Desperato Madalo. <sighs> it's a $186.7 here. $186.7. Uh, we really need it. Really need it. No six, no eight, no nine, no four. Need a big seven. That is a six. We lose the field as well. I am not. No four, no nine, no eight, and we're Gucci. No four, no nine, no eight, we're Gucci. This is on Bet Victor. This is on uh, Leo Vegas. This is on sportsbet.io, I heard. Two and two, ladies and gents. That's a big ol' hard four. We lose that one. Hundred dollar thirteen seven, please. Five out of six. Yo, yo, yo. Yo, yo, yo. For a minute, I thought you were doing mental math. That'd be pretty sick if I did. $113.7. Still live. $113.7. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Give me that seven. Give me that seven. One out of four. Yo, Auto on Live, what's up, man? What's going on? Hope you're doing well. Need that, need that seven. Need the seven bad. Need the seven bad. Need the seven bad. That is back to four. No, I, I don't play BJ, dude. 
I'm I'm over I'm over the blackjack streams, my brother. Over over the blackjack. Need a seven. Need a big red. Big red. Big red. Hundred and thirteen dollars seven. Let's go. Let's get this seven. Where is the seven? Where's the seven when you need the seven? Five, five. Five, five, fiver. So I was playing a modified uh, Iron Cross strategy last night where it's like uh, you play the don't pass on the initial come out and then you play the Iron Cross after. And it was doing okay because then on the seven. There we go, hundred and ten dollar seven. Thank you so much for the biddies, Dusty. Appreciate you, brother. We're back alive. We're still alive. We're still alive. Feels good. So watch. Like if I do this, if I do this. Five and a two, agents. Seven. Winner. Seven front line winner. You can't see me, right? <laughs> seven. That's seven bitty seven roll. Beautiful. Beautiful. A yo eleven pays forty eight. A yo eleven pays forty eight. Come on, dude. Yo eleven here. Yo eleven. Five and Let's go! Yeah. Let's go! Yo, 11, baby! 48 into the bin brings us back to life just a little bit. Just a tad. Okay, so here's this is what we do. So now that I have my don't pass set, I'm gonna pay like this. We could either take the odds on the don't pass five, or we could or we could place the odds on our win on the five. How do you even play craps? Uh, there's ways. There's ways to learn. YouTube is your best bet, probably. But there's a there's very there there's a few strategies, and um, you know, life goes on. We should have taken seven on the odds here. Yo, big ol' Andy, what's up? Big ol' Andy. Here we go. Team, my man. Six so and six, that. double six. Hold to see that. Well, grab it. That's it. Well done, Liam and the Bear. 110 must be staying on the field as well. Nine away. Bar the don'ts. Double the bubble. The house is in trouble. Double the field. Well done, Tim. Well done, man. One roll bet. Ladies and gentlemen, six hard six. Six hard six, ladies and gentlemen. Double treble, Martin 
the six down behind you. Alright, here we go. Modified. Hey, what's up, JR Truth Music? What's going on, bro? Modified Iron Cross with the Don't Pass strat. Modified Iron Cross with the Don't Pass. No, they're they're uh, they're poppables. It's almost like those sound like cheese puffs. <laughs> they're poppables. Two and a one. The jinx, which is a. Three craps three. Uh, nice. Two craps three. Looking for a monster oh, roll here. Looking for a monster roll, boys. I feel nine. I forgot about my forgot about my fucking field bet. Oh well. Forgot about my field bet. I forgot about the field. Uh, Mister Money was here earlier. That would have been $80 on the last roll. That would have been an $80 roll last roll. Yo, 11. You're saying what's a bet number? You, once you bet a number, you can't take it off. I don't think... Um, Justin, please contact um, customer support and they can talk you through it. At the moment, from what I'm getting, I don't believe you can. Six and a one, seven out. Seven. Ah! Oh. Let's get a monster roll, boys. Let's get a monster roll. Feeling a good one here. Feeling a decent roll here on this one. Just feeling a monster coming up soon here. Oh gosh. Not sure what that was. Probably a seven. Let's roll. Let's roll. Will they come on? We're about to find out now, bitch. We're about to find out now. There we go. Three and a two, ladies and gents. The Lady Godiva, the Racetrack Diver. Alive. Monster roll here, boys. We need a, we need a, we need a monster. We need a monster here. We need a monster roll. Can we get one? Can we get one? Can we get a monster roll. Five 
five and a four. Jesse James. Can we get a monster roll? Need a big one. Need a big one. I want to get big presses on the six and the eight. I want to get big presses on the field. Give me a monster roll. Give me a fiver, fiver. Racetrack driver. Let's get a big one here. Let's get a big one here. Oh boy. That's that's life, I guess. Need a big eleven. Need a big eleven. Big eleven here. Eleven, eleven, eleven. Big eleven. Four and a two. Four and a two. Snake eyes incoming, he says. Snake eyes incoming, he says. Oh, baby. Oh, God, what happened? Just got back. I'm oh, just so unlucky. Playing Iron Cross, playing Pass Line. Just, just no luck. Just no luck. <sighs> just no luck. You know, it is what it is. Just no luck. I don't know, babe. Not much longer, probably. Time for a run ski. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. Big run skis. Big run skis here. <sighs> Hopefully. Maybe. Hey, what's up, Ernie? What's going on, brother? How are you doing tonight, man? Where'd you find this? Yo, Tobias. Thank you so much for the follow, bro. Appreciate you coming out and hanging out with us. Much love, my dude. You love craps. I mean, we all love craps, bro. We all love craps. This is not the best version of craps, in my opinion, just because the rules are so shitty. 
What's up, Tobias? What's going on, man? Hello to you as well. We're going to go on a big run here. Big run. Monster roll. Monster roll. We've already made two points here. Monster roll. Fiverr. Fiverr. Uh, so you can't take any bets down. Uh, the odds are one to one behind. And um, you can't player control don't comes. Uh, what else? I don't know. There's some pretty bad rules. Like, think about think about the worst rules possible, and those are probably the rules for this game. The field, the field's always paying on these tables, though. They do hit a lot of field numbers on this. If you're playing the pass line, it's the same, right? No, because it's only one to one odds behind on the pass. Oh! Some people like classy, some people don't. The gentlemen and the ladies <laughs> like classy. Here we go. Six and a two, ladies and gents. Eight shoes and eight. Eight. I like a bit of everything. I just want a oh, monster roll, down. man. Why can't we get a monster roll here? That's right. Mark eight is marked. Why can't we get one monster roll? That's all I want. One monster roll. One monster roll. Two and a foul, ladies and gents. Six sheets of six, six e. Uh, this is this is actually uh, sportsbet.io or uh, Pornhub Casino. Taking the field. Those both offer. Those both those casinos both offer this game. Come on, dude. Seriously. Terrible. Terrible. When the iron, it's now, now the video is called when the iron cross goes wrong. I've been on the five and four, Jesse James. I've been on the opposite side of the correct call both times tonight. Or last night and tonight. The last uh, on the opposite line. That's right, ladies and gents. That's all. Last time I've been on the opposite side of both both nights. Okay, if we played if we played the don't come tonight, we would have been winning. If we played the if we played the iron cross last night, we would be winning. You know, that's just how it goes. That's just how it goes. When you're on the wrong side of both nights, that's just, that is just life. The comeback from four dollars is real, dude. Wouldn't it be pretty sweet if we actually had like a sick comeback from here? Nine is our top number. Anything can happen. Anything can happen. Big roll, big roll. Anything could happen. Anything could happen. Okay, four point rolls in a row after that. 
Let's proceed and roll the dice, guys. Let's do it. Let's get it for less gold. Damn, son. Where'd you find this? Yeah, thank you so much for the follow, my, my dude. Except your follow... Your follow was bad luck. Your follow was really bad luck. So... You, my friend, are forever in shame of your follow. Your follow is the worst luck. No luck on your follow. Very bad luck. <laughs> um, shit, dudes. All right, well, you know, it is what it is. Um... Craps has been interesting. It's been a it's been a it's been a wild ride, in all honesty. Uh no luck. No luck today at least. Um it look I mean it just proves the point that, you know, no strat is uh no strat can win on a regular basis we went don't pass last night we lost everything we went pass line iron cross tonight we lost everything so you know it comes down to uh, you just gotta be lucky you gotta get lucky and sometimes luck is not in my favor really ever to be honest I'm never really lucky, but <laughs> whatever. Thanks, guys. Appreciate you hanging out with me tonight. Till next time. Till another time. More craps soon to be happening. Yeah, thank you, man. Appreciate that, Night Dog. Yeah, of course. I mean, better luck next time. Better luck next time. Dice are out. It is what it is boys i'll see you later see you next time much love have a good night see you on the other side <laughs>